Okay, we're back here live in the uh, winners bracket semi-finals between uh, Western Wolves and Uprising. Uprising were two nil ahead, fairly convincingly in game one and two. However, Western Wolves just narrowly edged out the five four ten sponsor flag game. It did go past fifteen minutes. Um, big game out of Frankie there. He went plus fourteen. Yeah, he dropped like forty three kills, and he was the guy we were talking about that was being aggressive. And we saw him in. You know, we don't have his point of view to watch. You just see him in other people's screens, always under their base. And if you get inside their base, you're going to be getting cheap kills. He's played brilliantly and deserves it there. So, I mean, next game time, I'm not sure what it's going to be. Uh, capture the flag on... I love to see Capture the Flag Zealot or something like that. It's going to be a great game. I haven't seen much Zealot. No. I haven't seen a Zealot flag on here yet, so it'd be good to commentate on that. But we're going to start... Oh, I think flag. it's a Sank flag. So we're going to start off, I think, with a bit of a listening. Um, Listening to uh, Uprising as we go up from Baxter's point of view. Yeah, we'll start with Baxter because we've watched Chalk at the start of Saints, so we'll watch Baxter, we'll get, a, get an idea of how they're chatting, and then we'll come in, you know, towards the, in the middle of the game and, uh, you know, take you through to the end. Yeah, so we'll leave you to uh, Uprising. Yeah, yeah, that's actually so annoying. They were just playing like pussies at the start of it, to be fair, though. So. And, like, I kept, like, we weren't flanking enough, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They kept getting to our side, whereas we, we need to flank all when, the time, so you've got a guy on their side ready to pull it when, when you get, like, one, two down. When we got on their side, we always got a cup. They yeah. spent about ten minutes of that game on the side, and the, the they got this screaming yeah. scrape. Yeah. 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 Like, we need to just make sure that we're, sure we're, we're the one making the fucking play. We were playing their game far too much. Yeah. It's play hard, bitch. Game, so. Fucking announcements need to shut up, man. Let's go. Oh, that makes it louder. Oh, I'm not host, yes. That snipe bag with two shots. I'm pushing their career straight away. They're playing around right now. They're made to do it. 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 They're made to do Go go up to on the outside side. Up there, up there. Go go up to loot. Guys, what we rockets? Go shut you up. We rockets. I need a red break. I need a red break. Fifty-seven. One fifty-seven now. Absolutely, I need those. I gotta show you up. I gotta show you up. Killed the rockets. Steady, 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 steady. Nice. Two dead. Come on, set this up. Two dead. Frag me and chase the last two. I have a snipe. Oh, our window, our window. Our shooter. I'm watching our shooter. Where are they? He's on our window. Um, okay, oh, no, they're bomb pillars, they're bomb pillars. One shot up, bring that, bring that. Two there, Will and Avon, Avon. Avon, 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 they're, they're in front of them, two dead, there's one on the front of them. It's the last one, it's the last one. Yeah, Bob. Four, yeah. four, four dead, I'm in the shed. Four dead, still four dead. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Hot, 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 Jake, hot! Slay quick, slay quick. Two guys. Oh, shit. They're two dead, one in hot, one in hot weak. JC, three down. JC's one shot. JC's one shot still. I got JC. One shot the two. Pillars in the two. Watch that pillars for seven. There's one in the two. There's one in the two. There's one in the two. Follow me. Andy, I'll try to kill him, you guys just run it. He's sniping five. I got him, man. He's absolute absolute slow round. Nice. Two guys, no. Two guys are one. Two guys are one. I'm dead. I'm dead. Five guys are one. Jc's one shot. Jc's one shot. Pillar one. There's one. There's one. One shot. Two there. On the flank. One shot. On the flank. One shot. Push now. Jump. Also there. Ring two. Ed's on my guy again. He's off his one. Come on, man. Two guys jump. One guy shot. One guy jump. And there he is. I'm hearing two. Between right side rings up. I'm hearing two. 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 Two and a half, two and a half, I can't, I can't play that. That car is still weak, man. Watch that bomb, watch that bomb. Out window now, Jason. Watch our jump up. Ring one, I've got 20. Ring one now, I've got one. I've seen one, I've got one. I've got 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 one, I've got one. Running that main. We didn't take down Bond. Let's go straight to Ring one, Ring one, Ring one now. They got rockets on. Our window, our window. Yeah, we have to slam up there. Is Aris one? Aris That's one, 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 one shot. Frag nice one shot. Pillars. One shot. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
Arving one now, up on now, Arving one. He's dead, he's dead. Let's go. 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 Help him, help him, they're 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 Ring one, it's going to be ring one. Ring one, 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 Jump, 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 jump,
Push us now, push us now, push us now. Push us now, push us now, push us now. Push us now, push us now, push us now. Push us now, push us now, push us now. Jump in our hands, man. 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 One shot, shoot forward, shoot forward, we'll shoot forward. Oh, oh, they're gonna run this as rockets, they're gonna run this as rockets, man. I'll shoot, one shot, shoot wing two, shoot wing two. Another guy, two guys on one, black guys on the door, black guys on the door. One shot, 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 one I'm on you, I'm going to call it rocks. They're pushing back, we know. There's Remy, Remy is rocks there. They're jumping up weak back stuff. Being too weak guard, being too weak guard to go in the pistol. Oh, do I have to it now, Andy, weak. I got one shot on him. What's happening, Remy's going to go. Remy's going to go. I think there's another one. Last man, waste his time, waste his time. Remy's going to go. Stay alive, stay alive. Remy's going to go. Remy's going to go. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. You're running flying towards the rockets. Running flying towards the rockets now. I don't believe that. I don't believe that. We come the flag and I come the flag. 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 Flag is weak, flag is weak, flag is one shot, flag is one shot, flag is one shot, there's no one near him. Have you help him? Help him, flag is one shot, flag is one shot, flag is one shot. Wait, wait, help him. See that, see that, see that. He's got my side, he's got my side. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. 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 Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Need to go, need to go, need to go, need to go. Need to go, get to Will, get help him. Three guys, three guys, three guys, one dead, one dead. Hello? Yeah, we're back. We, I hope you enjoy listening as much as we did. That was amazing. We were talking about Frederick stepping up as a leader. You can hear it in their voice chat there. He is doing a lot of the work in the Fires leading the team. And they are up in this game 2-1. Just saved the flag and that's on a, basically on the uprising flag point. Took out Baxter. Great play out of Buck 20. This is the sort of Western Wolves that I thought could have could arrived at this event. And they are playing out of their minds here to bring it back. We should mention as well that uh, Western Wolves have now enlisted the help of uh, MVP from Apex Power uh, to help them uh, block 20 goes on the killing spree and uh, MVP is helping them tie the weapons and move that flag down. Uh, the Rockets are I think at this point, is it 18 minutes or 19 minutes? 19, so they've got another minute left. But Buck 20's managed to get that flag all the way to his side. And this could be it. This could be 3-1, game over. Uh, take, take into the game five, yeah. And after Baxter got up and started talking, you want to save that stuff when you know you're going to win. And um, So, yeah, we see it. Oh, Buck 20 taken out, not managed to get that flag in. Um, could, be a pulled it. could be a counter cut. A lot of Western Wolves guys dead here. Great play out of Uprising. They managed to oh, pull that back from the brink. Sure. And that is going to be that. That is going to be a counter cap. Two all probably going to be this game. Yeah, and it seems to have stalled on the run a little bit. No, we're watching Buck 20. That is going to be a cap. Two all. And um, oh, that was an amazing play of Uprising. Clutch it. They, they still haven't managed to put this flag in, though. Where is it? Oh, it's on their street now. They've got to put it in. Yeah, Chalky runs it in off stream as a. Uh, Ramirez still causing havoc on the flag. Nice shots out. Nice shots out. Alex, buck 20 there. Great play for him. And now those rockets are going to be up, and I think 127 is going to be trying to pounce on them as quickly as Bradley was in there, but he's dead, and Will's gone down as well, so maybe Uprising will have the rocket. They do have the rockets in the hands of, I think it is Baxter. Baxter he's got him. We might put him on, but he goes down. Oh my goodness. Rami. Rami. Oh, <laughs> Ramirez. What happened? So that was a, you know, Two retards trying to hump a doorknob. <laughs> <laughs> Flipping, just beating down the air, the pair of them. But a uh, bit of a two ways to rockets there. He needed to use those because it's all tied up. If they've got it, now they can't just hold back and try and they have to try and get the victory here. But Buck 20, again, I mean, much more aggressive play from there, a much more sensible, aggressive play uh, of Western Wolves than we saw in the first two games. The last couple they've been, the last couple of games they've been playing much better, that sort of controlled aggression, rather than either just running or just hiding. They're waiting for the right times to push and doing it very well. 57 nearly taken out. But at, oh, Rami, you can't. That is such an... Oh, don't name yourself. Such an advantageous... Oh, my God, he <laughs> mentioned the Troy Will. Oh, Jesus, that is massive. Oh, God, that's three dead of his team. Uh, but luckily, I think um, Bradley's still holding Bradley's, strong. Bradley's uh, stepping up, holding strong. But you know, when you're in a window like that, you can't. It's one of those weird ones because you don't want to back down because you're in an advantageous position. We also don't want to get embarrassed. So like, oh, chalky. Uh, no scope through the smoke for a double. 
we might have to go on board and have a little look at Chalky Scott tonight. He is in red health though, wait till he's put his shield back so he don't commentate his cursing as he pushes it into their side of the map. So we go back on board with Chalky now, he's just pushing very aggressively in with Jack, that is back to the Yeah, using uh, the jetpack and snipe. Back to oh, JC has to do some work here. Uh, stays alive nicely. Uh, Riley takes him out. Uh, this isn't looking good for the Western Wolves. Um, a, lot of, a lot of uprising all over their base. Uh, I think Vars can be taken out. Yeah, nice work. Out of one of the box, 20 I think it is. And Ramirez, you have got to get Rami out of your snipe. He's been a pain. Like, just you've got to get him. You can't have a guy in your snipe for Western Wolves. Yeah, he gets a new snipe. Bam. See you later, JC. Eat that, son. And again, you did say, um, you know, Western Wolves do have a chance of urgency now and their voices after that game. Uh, great job, Jack, uh, that has taken about much money. Um, I, but I think that's going to suck even harder if they now lose this game. Being yeah, it's going to be awful because Bax is going to be talking so much about how you choke that 2 1 lead when you're miles ahead. Um, yeah, nice work. Chalky, very, very consistent side, but ooh, I mean, that's a tough shot. Uh, sometimes you will get them, sometimes you don't. Two all. We got, I think we'll, this looks like it's going to go into overtime. Neither team is just to pull a flag for 30 seconds from there. Uh, new Rockets are up, are in 20 seconds, I believe. Yep. Um, so that is going to be a big, big deal. Oh, JC again. Oh my God, Chalky. Uh, yeah, but got a bit, got a bit no scope happy there. Um, Robert and uh, I think Western Wolves looking in a far better position. They're in their flag, and they have a guys in ring to pull Rockets when they go. Oh my God, I think. I think we just saw a bad move from Buckingham Machine. You see him pushing, he was in ring, ready for rockets, and he pushed out, and now Chalky's managed to flank JC. Oh, JC has got the rocket, so he's having to reload them. Mm, see, they had to get control of those rockets. Buckingham should have stayed. Uh, well, we did have a go at him being passive, right, it was a bit right. aggressive there, but four down for Western Wolves, and they are going to, and uh, Uprising are going to pull the flag, and they're going to be running it through health pack, and, um, no, running it, sorry, not through health pack, through snipe, and it looks like they're away, away with this flag now. What do you think of that run, run along the uh, street there? Is that a sensible play or is it like a bit of a question of one? I think so because you've got that cover from that little wall there and once you get into ring two, um, it's very hard for the other team to, to, to kind of follow in and get that. Um, what I can notice though from uh, when you see Jack Baxter is even though the, the flag has not been stopped, Jack is still back in um, the uh, Western Wolf race that is now playing again. It's causing all kinds of damage. He's doing a great job to stay alive. And this is yeah, just great work out, Jack. He's so, so good at doing this sort of thing. Such a pain. He is taken out, but he's run that flag a long way. But three death right now. Like, I think I think George is going to say, no thanks, you know, I don't want to do that flag. Uh, leave it. We're not in position to run it. Great work from Jack to distract them. Prevented Western Wolves getting control of the map because they had to go out and clear out their side. But I don't think they're looking like anywhere near like capping that flag and it does reset. No. So we're deep into overtime now. Obviously, next flag will win. It would win anyway. It's 3 2. Probably gets taken out. Uh, nice. I think it was a body shot from Ramirez. Oh, I think Hard has got the side. He's doing a little bit of it. Um, yeah, so I mean, very even game. I mean, obviously, it's like scrappy now, isn't it? Yeah, it's got a little scrappy. Either team's got a lot of control. Next, ro next rockets will be up in about a minute and a bit. 12-10, uh, so... Pretty sure it's going to crack me there. Just yeah, Frank, Alec, Frankie is playing really well. Really recovered from that early loss. He's put up 40 kills and now he's confident. Playing well. But he's going to sit on an aid there. Great work. Great work out back. It's a great anticipation. Ed gets cleaned up by a guy in his courtyard, but there's three uprising for Red Spartans there. Going to whip on Frankie. JT pushes street, but he's on his own here. He's going to just have to try and stay alive. He's very isolated on this map. Doing a good, good job, but that's oh, great work from JC. He managed to clean up Rami, uh, had no right to get that kill. And now three dead, yeah, JC. brilliant JC. So that sort of play is so anonymous, no one will ever talk about it. But great, great play for him. And out of Western Wolves able to push on the flag, and oh, lots Rami. and lots of pressure on the uprising spawns here. Chalky just completely shut down both runners in one grenade there. Great play by Chalky. Yeah, a lot of pressure, but I think they're going to be all right. I don't think that Western Wolves going to be able to capitalise and he's going to get a cap. JC doing great job getting kills when he shouldn't there. Help Frankly out for an assist. For an assist from Ramirez, Buck 20 clean like Baxter, 2v2 at the moment, Chalky alive and Edvard and uh, Buck 20 having a good fight with Chalky on their rock, takes him out uh, but he gets native, so very even moment, 2v2s all the time, no team really did any control, Ed flying a kite gets blown up, <laughs> yeah. uh, 12 minutes left to go now, rockets, now. rockets go up, Bradley, oh he needs to get a kill here, can't, do not, oh my, Alex man, come on, he had, had help in ring 2, that other guy in ring 2 should have taken him out there, um, Get four alive, three of them dead. You know, 
rocket is such an advantage that now someone else can have to get the rockets and reload. Seven does have them, but even Buster Seven dies with them as well. Victor Seven's yeah. gone down with them, not putting those rockets to best of use. I mean, good play from Baxter, he knew the rockets were there, caused trouble, you know, he was in the right place at the right time, but not the greatest play for Crabby to get taken out of them. But oh, anyway, Matt. Yeah. And that pushes in even harder on uh, Buster Seven. Into weird angles here for Seven and Baxter's fight, but Baxter is all over their base now. Two players dead, so he's just going to try and get in them and pressure the spawns rather than really going for a flag ball just yet. Uh, Nay's not doing anything but twenty lovely shots though, not missing. Um, but taken out by the spawners in rocks, no one there to block them or pressure them. Nice, nice that chalky. Uh, takes him out of the spawn. JC, uh, no, not happening. So this, is, this is Jack's role, I think, on this team is to be that big distraction. Um, throughout the game, he's been holding forward, really desperately trying to uh, relieve the pressure of his team. Of course, he's been dying a little bit because of that. But however, when he does get into the other team race, he is causing problems. Yeah, I mean, I mean pretty much the reason that Western Walls aren't able to get control is because Jack is always behind them. Yeah. Um, so you have to get that guy at your base first, and he just stops. He stops the kind of three, four dead situations when all the other team are alive. Because yeah. generally he's put enough shots in for Western Walls to be one dead or two dead whenever they get all of uprising down, which has stopped the pulling of flags since they were very dominant, dominant in the start of this game while on the listen in. Jack coming off spawn now, um, not really under a much pressure on spawn. Crabby going to push it. I think Crabby's going to take it out. Oh, oh Alec, well, Crabby, nice playing shot. Playing really well this series. Yeah, really on it. This is the Fabi I remember from earlier on in Reach when he was, uh, you know, everyone was trying to pick him to be the next kind of big player. Yeah. Going through the ranks. He's playing very, very well. So we see Baxter again coming off spawn. Ed, Barb with the snipe. Two, oh, in, in trouble. That is about the third time I've seen Buffett do that exact move. Coming out of the bond, chasing down the kill, and just getting punished for it. Yeah, you've got to, you've got to choose your fights, really. You can't, you know... You've got, to, you've got to question whether you getting weak is worth killing someone else, you know, in those yeah. situations. And if if you just go one for one, when you had a position of advantage, then it's not. Um, if you go, like, two for one, and you do, don't have a position of advantage, it's great. But someone's got a snipe. JC picks up Baxter on his health pack, and, um, you know, it's all... Still very close. Another rocket's coming up at 9:10-ish, uh, so you know maybe we're going to be looking at that for the next thing to start the push. Neither team can really here. There's going to be some big kills with the you know <laughs> the stats. One for the one for the stat guys here. As we see carrying on going, uh, Baxter just see there he, the route he took there was just checking his base. He was just checking over at his snipe side, making sure no one pack before he pushed out. Really solid. Took him maybe two seconds of movement to have a look there. But great play. Oh, oh right there. We've got seven. Uh, actually, Baxter turned his back there because he thought Ray was dead. Three down now for Uprising, but great play for Jockey, but four down, uh, just far coming off spawn. And Uprising can get the rockets. Uh, you know, Uprising have no right to get these rockets. Yeah, they don't. Oh my god, JC misses them. Uh, oh, Baxter doing an amazing job here. They had absolutely no right to get that power no, weapon. Second time in the road, Western Walls have failed with the rockets. They've wasted them, and they were three dead coming off spawn. All of Western Walls were alive and in the ring and they lost rocket control. That is a massive, massive deal with nine minutes left to go in this game. Uh, but through seven, I believe is the last one alive. I think Uprising have lost a lot of players. Um, so there's like, oh, 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 my, well, geez, doing amazing. Chalky tries the flash in the ring two, doesn't do it. Uh, but neither team really managed to capitalize on rockets there. Um, obviously, Westall's lost them, and then, oh, Fragby. Oh, Fragby, show me the five. Show me the five, that is amazing play at him. Bump to seven, having a great game out of him actually. We're still going to stop on Bob with uh, Bump to seven. Yeah, they switch over to Bump to seven. for a while, three dead for um, all the uprising boys. The Red Spartans, uh, uh, Ed's in them all sorts of advantage there. He can't, no, don't. That is ridiculous. Why would you peek out there? Chalky's obviously watching you. Come on, you're better than that, Will. Will needs to make sure they can make it. You can't give those silly deaths away against players, it's good. No, no, it's just no. never going to happen. Oh, oh, back to ring one. Yeah, back to get taken out. Well, yeah, you know, you've got to just death like that against, you know, sort of top six teams, not going to matter. But against the top, top teams, then it starts to matter. You can't give those sort of simple kills away because you put your team under so much pressure. Yeah, 20 clean up that kill for 57 DMR. Good awareness there. Heard, heard, obviously heard the jetpacker, took him out. Oh, chalky, really nice play. Great crouch, mixing it up in the strafe. Uh, really nice. Oh, he just gave it to JC on the Yeah, he, yeah, he stayed alive there, took out JC. So, good, good play out of him. Uh, 57 coming off spawn, looking around, trying to find someone. No real pressure on his spawn. Jet Baxter uh, took about four shots in there, but then gets the, gets the, 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 the snipe headshot. And uh, neither, uh, oh, yeah, Baxter, nice work staying alive, but gets the, ends up getting taken out. No team really had control since, since the second tire up was in cap, really. No. No team's had any sort of extended period of control. And now, again, the next big thing going up in the game is going to be the Rockets at 6 minutes 20. And I haven't seen a game this long so far at the tournament. 
very, very, very tight. Very close game between these two. No team really seeming to have control. West Ham also control of the ring for quite some time, but it seems that every time that actually matters is when the Rockets fall, they just lose it. Um, and they, are, they haven't been able really. Most of the action has been taking place in the ring or in West Ham's place. There's not been a lot happening in um, Uprising's place. Yeah, now we see it. Now it looks like a good, uh, Fabi needs to clear up. Uh, no, he doesn't. This, could, this is going to be a flag call, and maybe if they can pull it and then grab the Rockets, this is going to be very, very dangerous. They've got to take out the flag runner here. I don't think they're going to... Uh, back, so I think it is just taking his time on it. Good, Great good time. help. But they're really too smart, too experienced for that. They shut down C, and now Rockets should be up in 10 seconds. They've got to have to clean oh, out their Ramirez. base and then push. Ramirez just pushed the butt 20 on that shield and didn't kill him. Oh, Rami, that is unfortunate, Andy. And the flag resets. Flag resets. Rockets should be coming up, though. They have, both teams have to fight for these. These are so, so vital at this stage of the game. This, you know, it's only one, there's maybe one more set of Rockets after these. This is the, one of the yeah. few times in the game you're going to have that massive advantage. Uh, I think Uprising must have them because they have ring control. Well, they are two dead, so all of Westmore's are alive. Yeah, he's Chalky's got him. Oh my god! 57 sticks, Chalky with the rockets gets taken out. Now three down, last guy alive is in the, um, the Uprising yeah, courtyard, pushed on the carbine. Uh, Fabi got a bit mental uh, in Bonfire. Oh my god, the great rating from uh, Chalky. I think he's completely accidental. Oh Jesus, what? These it's rockets, are they, there's now just a rocket curse in this game. No one sees better using them. You get them, you just get messed up, and that is obviously. A compliment of the way the team. Oh my God, Chalky! Jesus, no right to win that fight. Absolutely no right at all. Takes out for seven. Uh, Backs to get a bit messy in ring two there. And uh, again, so the Rockets. We, we hyped them up for about a minute. Nothing happened. Yeah. Tees blue to the up. Great stick at seven to save the day. And, um, yeah. Most of all, it all seems to be kind of taking it in turns to see who can go big. I mean, I think I think I've seen killing sprees out of all four the players. I mean, it's the JC turn just a minute ago. We only have five minutes left in regulation time, which only means I think two more sets of rockets left, um, three more sets of ri uh, sniper rifles, and uh, really oh, just time Fabi, that was an ambitious jetpack there. Maybe the wrong decision. Um, if this game does run out of time, I think the tournament admins will probably do a sudden death first catch to win. I think that's the way it goes. But as we are already really in that situation, um, so Chalky gets a nice snipe from uh, under his from his uh, jump up, pushes into ring two. As uh, we're still on ball seven here. Doing some good, good work. But again, neither team really had a lot of control. This could be it. Look, look at the amount of red spots in their in their base. Three down now for Western Walls. Um, they're going to they're pulling it and they've got them trapped spawning it. Yeah, this looks like it. this could yeah. be a good push. Probably has killed though. Much more than this. Oh, that is a spawn and a half. But as I always say, you're always saying contrary. If you don't block them, they can spawn there. Yeah. Um, so you know they don't spawn there for no reason. Exactly. You can block spawns on these games and you can force them to fall the flag off at the And that is bad for West Park Rise, and they're probably without that spawn there, they would have got it, but they weren't in a position to block it. They slightly overextended on the pool and didn't have a guy to stay flag slash back rocks to yeah. really block that. The sniper rifles have spawned, new rockets will spawn on this minute at 3.10, so 30 seconds of new rockets, they're going to be absolutely pivotal. Very, um, very uh, good sniper control. Um, the fact that did have it for this delicious, I'm not sure who has it for um, Western Wolves, but Again, very back and forth. When you just think, when you just begin to think that one team will have control, it disappears. It disappears. It's very, very hard. Uh, very hard for any team. I mean, they're all so on point. It's very difficult for teams. I mean, Baxter, great work now. Now, Rockets are for fine. me, Baxter, I know he's pushing in. I know he's trying to stop this, but I think because Baxter's the more aggressive, I think we're going to. Oh, JC versus Baxter. Western Wolves in absolutely no position to contest these Rockets. So I would have thought Uprising should have them. Oh, hard. Just nowhere there for some reason. Rami's, Rami's got the rockets here. He's two. He's two. No. Oh, see again, the team not capitalising the rockets, but I mean, maybe that's just the team just so good without the rockets. Do you know what I mean? Like they're pushing yeah. very well, they know exactly how to do it. Flag is on the move. Oh my god, Flag, we, you might have heard him there howling on our mics. We heard it from here. Yes, this could be it. This is a great way. Great they're actually running the flag. Look at where the flag is. In the hands of Buckle 7 with the rockets. Oh, yeah, he hasn't fumbled, he's going to put it in. There we go, Western Wolves, major game. Jesus, a 25 minute plus game. And Western Wolves 2 0 down, level it up to all. And the faces on the, uh, the, face on the uprising team tell the story. Fabi dropping a 60 killer. Um, 
We can get the stats up. Buck 20's got them up. Fair beat, 60, 19 and 52. Chalky, 54 plus. Rough game out of Rami, negative 10. But rough game out of Baxter as well. But you only had to have a slightly rough game because it was like 28 minutes long to get yeah, the early from Chalky again. Yeah, Baxter didn't have a good one, pushing very hard, but you know, a really high death count. Look at the assists from Western Wolves. Yeah, all, all, all high all double digits. digits. Really well, good play. Two, three assists, 19, 17, 16, 19 assists. Yeah, and that, I mean, Uprising now, I mean, we're talking about the momentum team, game 